And Dr. Kent Hamilton is joining us with Excellent Periodontist. Good to see you. Good to see you again. Ah, we've got to talk about keeping the mouth healthy. It's so important. Thank you. I love that. The audience is on top of things this morning. We're talking about the mouth and implants and uh, all sorts of different things this morning. You know, you always talk to me about gums being healthy. Right. Our mouth, if our mouth isn't healthy, we're not healthy, right? Exactly, exactly. So what do we need to know about dental implants this morning? It's a long-term solution for folks who have teeth problems? Exactly. You know, dental implants have been becoming more and more applicable to all dental situations in the last several years. Okay. And it is the perfect long-term solution lasts longer than any other dental restoration that we do now. But just a second, I want to say hello to a surprise to some of my patients in the audience. Thank you all for being here. Oh, that's here. good. I love that. You know, a lot of people want to toss their dentures and go with implants because they're tired of having to take them out every day. But what about the long term? Is that something that's easy to do to go from, you know, dentures to implants? It's, it's I wouldn't use the word easy, but it's very predictable to go from dentures to implants. The reason we really like the patient to consider that is the denture is a constant changing thing. Okay. The minute you lose your teeth, the bone continues to resorb and resorb and resorb, and the denture doesn't fit. You get a new one after a while. It doesn't fit, and so you're, it's a constantly changing problem. Okay. With the implant, it stabilizes it. It stops the bone loss and gives you something that will be permanently there in your mouth to give you a great smile and functional for long years. Okay. Have. How long does it take to get something like dental implants? Is it a long-term process, or can it be done in the same day? Well, it can be done. The, getting the implant can be done the same day, okay. which is the thing I wanted to mention today is that if you lose it, if we fracture a tooth, break a tooth, have a filling flop that can't be replaced, we can put your implant in that day, okay. and you leave with that space filled. Now, you get the permanent tooth, mm -hmm. the porcelain tooth, the cap, Usually in about 8 to 12 weeks. Okay. So if you accidentally trip over the hose or something and you bust a tooth, you can fix that in a day so that we don't have to walk around with a chipped tooth. And then the long term comes a little bit later. Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. That's good to know. Very important stuff. Let's take a look at some before and after pictures because we'll show you how simple it is to go from something that's fractured or doesn't look that good to a completely new set of teeth. All right, here we have one of your, is one of your patients before. Here's the after. It's a huge difference. Right. It's, it's, it's exactly what we're talking about. Beforehand, the patient had periodontal disease, had teeth that couldn't be saved, teeth that were malaligned, teeth that you could not have orthodontic work on. Mm -hmm. They came in their office, we removed the teeth, we placed implants, and they walked out that day wow. with a set of teeth. Okay, let's take a look at the next before and after picture. That's a person suffering from a lot of gum disease. A lot of gum disease, yeah. a lot of bone loss, a lot of Whoa. infection. Whoa, that's and this a is huge the before and after difference. Pictures, right. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay, we've got one more before and after to show you. Again, a lot of people, they'll be looking at these pictures and saying, you know, I've got something like that. I'm dealing with something. What keeps them from coming in to get that fixed? I think the first thing that keeps them coming in is lack of knowledge. They don't know what can and can't be done. And the other thing is just fear. Mm -hmm. When we do these procedures, they're all done with, with anesthesia. Our patients report very little discomfort. I'll be honest with you, my biggest problem is that the patients don't have any pain, so they don't follow the instructions the day after. But, uh, we've, we've been doing this for over 20 years, and we've got a protocol that will give you something long-lasting without discomfort. The majority of our patients go back to work the next day. Really? Yeah. Matter of fact, one of the things that actually brought us on the show was a patient was, had gone back into work, and her coworkers go, did you change your hairstyle? She goes, no, <laughs> I got new teeth. And so that's what we're looking for in, in advances in dentistry today. It makes such a difference with your self-esteem when you're able to smile and show off those pearly whites versus having fractured or, or you know, broken teeth, doesn't it? Oh, exactly. Yeah. And, I mean, we have, we have many examples in our office where patients of, I mean, my age are going to their second marriage or whatever, their second wedding, and in, the, in their wedding vows, all of a sudden their denture flips out. I mean, oh. You don't want to have that. We do not want that. No, no, no. Well, thank you so much for coming by today, Dr. Hamilton. <coughs> you saw some amazing before and after pictures. If you are interested in doing something like this, dental implants, the way to go with the right doctor. So definitely call Excellent Periodontist. They've got three area locations in San Antonio and New Braunfels, excellentperiodontist.com, or call right now and set up a consultation at 496 5603. Again, 496 5603.